Welcome, Capricorn. Thank you for listening to your reading of May 10th, 2023 on your Zodiac Attraction channel, where you will know what the future holds, both in money, your numbers for today, love, health, work and family. So subscribe to the channel, so you don't miss anything. The moon continues its journey through your sign this morning, darling sea goat, though a harsh opposition to passionate Mars could stir drama within matters of the heart. These vibes will be passionate and tense, making it important that you maintain a neutral disposition and avoid setting anyone off with passive-aggressive behaviors. Your emotions may bubble to the surface just before evening settles in, so you may want to lay low from home after work. Luckily, you'll feel more grounded and centered when the moon enters Aquarius and cozies up to Pluto, helping you shake off any bad vibes that found you earlier. A close friend may share some vital secret with you. You need to be very discreet with this information and offer appropriate sympathy and advice. Tackle all the tasks in your life in a constructive way. Your actions are especially powerful now and are likely to have a long-term effect on those around you. So, you need to be careful about what you say or do. Your mind is aligned with your emotions today, and they will push you forward one moment, then perhaps prove problematic the next. This energetic vibration is due to the moon spending the day in your sign and your first house of self-expression and action. Things might not be all that intense though with Venus currently camped out in your seventh house of one-on-one -on -one relationships and contracts adding an extra dose of pleasure to all your relationships and legal matters. This transit can be very useful for increasing your own value, especially if you make a point to partner up during this time, but today there's going to be a dissonance between what you want and what we want. Perhaps your goals and your partner's goals aren't exactly on the same page, or you have different ways of handling matters. This doesn't have to spell disaster, Hold off on discussions for a few days and by the time next week rolls around you'll likely find a solution that works best for all parties. This week, new opportunities will emerge. You must be prepared for a full week of labor because you have so much on your plate. Attempt to be as productive as possible. This week, prior payments will readily begin to clear up, resulting in a significant improvement in financial conditions. Prior investments and speculative transactions will yield unexpectedly high returns. Due to the clumsy errors of your employees, you will encounter a number of unforeseen obstacles, which will test your patience. Even more damage is possible if you are furious with your employees, so no matter how difficult it may be, you must learn to be compassionate. With the exception of work, you will have a wonderful week. You will experience a great deal of affection from family and acquaintances as well as your partner. This week will be difficult, but you will feel supported and cared for in every way. By the end of the week, you will feel very content with where you are in life. There can be some mixed signals today, dear Capricorn, but they're likely to be minor. Nevertheless, communications are tricky. Restlessness can lead to unusual whims or desires, but your heart may not be fully into it. You might only need a change of pace. Differences in problem areas are in stronger focus, and it may not be easy to see around them temporarily. You may need to get something off your chest. You are inclined to go your own way, but you also seek acknowledgement from others, which is complicated. Keep the status quo if possible now. Watch for an attraction to a big purchase or commitment that eventually would interfere with your freedom. Now we will tell you how it will go with money and luck, but first remember to give us a like, subscribe to the channel and activate notifications, this helps us a lot and so you never miss your daily reading. Money and luck. Be open to unique ways of attaining security, Capricorn. As a traditionalist, you usually opt for a tried and true route with your career and finances to avoid crazy twists in your stability. But you might feel a little differently when the moon enters Aquarius today. The lunation will encourage you to have an open mind to unconventional routes with making money or handling your money. Although this could push you out of your comfort zone, it might be worthwhile since you could find a unique budget that works for your values and financial stability. Dealing with financial matters in a totally relaxed way, others may be stressed and fearful, but you cope with the situation in a straightforward and calm manner. 
You are courageous enough to act at the right moment and to make profits. Don't overdo it, because pride comes before a fall and you would ruin all you achieved. You're probably feeling a little less inclined towards focus at this time, Capricorn, and may feel a desire to keep yourself to yourself under this moon. It's an important time of contemplation for you and you may find yourself thinking about your current financial situation and how the past has impacted you. Now is the time to assess and think of new ways of doing things. Try and take some time in nature as this helps to rejuvenate you and can also broaden your perspective, enabling you to find new solutions to old problems. Conversations with others about your finances can also be very productive for you in the coming future, so feel free to speak your mind today, Capricorn. Lucky Numbers Your lucky numbers for May 10th are 10, 31, 46, 15, 52, 20. Daily Love The stars spin ever on, never once to be in the exact same place at the same time, Capricorn. You are in a very rare and unique period of your life, as mighty Jupiter, the great benefic planet of miracles, expansion, and blessings, adds his weight to your solar fourth house of domesticity. This began in 2022 and has echoed out through 2023 until now. However, this will only continue for a few more days, until May 16, 2023. This ensures that couples will have more time to enjoy with their families or may even decide to renovate or redecorate. Real estate matters could be on the docket to discuss with your partner, too. Your thirst for action and your energy also affect your relationship positively. Not only are you keeping your partner busy with all sorts of different undertakings, you are also striving for excitement, diversion, and experiments in the bedroom. If your partner is ready for all that it is good and well. But be careful that you don't overwhelm him or her. The moon is in Capricorn and in your 1th house, however it is also squaring Neptune in your third house of communication. This planetary configuration is highlighting that while it is important to share the more private and hidden parts of yourself with your partner and be in open communication about them, it is also important to be able to talk about other things. For example, common mental pursuits and interests, it doesn't always have to be all so serious and deep. It is healthy and even necessary to be able to talk to your partner about most things, even the ones you would consider little or insignificant. It is good to make sure that you and your partner have clear slash open communication and mental resonance with one another. At work. This is the day to bring a change in your professional and money life. So if you have any such plans, just let yourself be free. You will find it easy to approach the top managers and to communicate to them effectively your notions. This is the best chance to maximize your income from your employer. There's plenty of time to consider new and bigger developments, very little stands in the way of your progress. By cleverly concentrating on the most important aspects of your work project, you minimize the possibility of getting too involved in unimportant detail and avoid any distractions or complications. The moon is in Capricorn today and in your 1th house. Are there any negative, hidden feelings that you may have about your work, but don't allow yourself to see? Do you have the willingness and courage to bring those things to your awareness so that you can change them? These are very questions to reflect on today. So often we don't find joy or pleasure in what we do, because we are relevant too afraid of looking at the things that aren't positive. But that ends up unconsciously sabotaging your potential to get to where you want in your career or achieve what you set out to. The moon is also squaring Neptune in your third house. This is highlighting that a lot of good can come out of expressing those feelings of discontent to the people you work with, in a wise and respectful way of course. Health Look for partners who are willing to share healthy habits with you. Beware of those who ask you to fulfill their personal interest without giving any weight age to yours. They are just trying to encash you emotionally by making you put your health at stake for their gain. If they press you very hard then just move on. You're composed, relaxed and possess a sensible attitude towards your fitness. Little prevents you from pushing yourself to the limit and you're able to handle energetic activities where you show extraordinary resilience and strength. You appear to be totally unconcerned about the future, be prepared for changes. 
Your confidence is heightened today, Capricorn, but it's important that you don't let your ego take over your actions. Try balancing the chakras to create harmony within the body and allow your confidence to blossom in a healthy manner. Try working with chakra stones today, as they balance the chakras easily and leave you feeling refreshed. Hold chakra stones in your left hand and breathe deeply to encourage harmony. Greek yogurt contains probiotics, which are good bacteria that increase gut health. For breakfast, try topping a bowl of Greek yogurt with berries and granola today. Family and friends. Today, there is a possibility that you will become less approachable. The day is not best suited for cultivating new or old relationships. Instead, you will be more concerned with self-analysis and this can give off a vibe that you do not want to be disturbed. However, you may call up an old friend or get a surprise visit from someone close to you from your past. Your attention is going to be divided between your wants and your needs, and how they correlate with those of someone else. The moon is spending the day in your sign and your first house of self-expression and action. This is all well and good, but today sensual Venus, currently in your seventh house of one-on-one -on -one relationships, sends out a jealous beam to the moon begging for you to turn your attention back to the special someone in your life. This can actually be a quite pleasurable transit if you have the time to let loose, but don't be surprised if you find it difficult to manage both your obligations and your pleasures all at once. Deal with one thing at a time and by nightfall you can slip away for an evening of excitement. Singles should try and mingle, even if only on an app, a potential partner could make themselves known tonight. We love that you get to this part of the video, don't forget to subscribe, like it and leave us your comments, at Zodiac Attraction we always read them and see you tomorrow, have a nice day.